Right, Prime Minister Narendra Modi has said cruel twist of faith has really snatched away a young, very talented, extraordinary human being. Puneet Rajkumar is no more. I have with me some of the panelists joining us to give an insight into how they remember Puneet Rajkumar, an actor par excellence, a human being, extraordinary. Shamila Mandre joining us, an actor herself, Indrajit Lankesh. Uh, a film director joining us, Parul Yadav, who's an actor herself. We also have Vivek Mahajan, who's an international cardiologist with Fortis Hospital. Let me quickly cut across to Nolan Pinto before that. Uh, Nolan, take us through exactly what you see at the Kantinava Stadium. We understand that the entire Karnataka cabinet, the chief minister, along with his ministers, are currently present at Kantinava Stadium uh, to bid final goodbye. But the cremation will not take place today. We believe that they are, the family is waiting for Puneet's daughter to come back or come down from the United States and that will take place on Sunday morning. Take us through the details of it please and show us what's behind you. Nabila, we have, we have been here since, since about 5 in the evening and we have seen how the preparations were actually done over here, the measures being put in place by the government as well as the police. Now, one can really say that they have done a fabulous job. Uh, fans were allowed in, say, about half an hour ago. And I'm showing you those visuals as of now. You can see, I, I think just from the entrance to the time they can actually pay their last respects to his body, maybe about 5,000 at any particular point of time are there. And what we are told, in fact, the commissioner of police, when I spoke to him, he says that fans, his fans who are coming from across the state will be able to come here, pay their last respects throughout the night tomorrow the entire day and mostly till midnight and like you rightly stated uh, the final rites will take place with full state honors chief minister basraj uh, state stated that at, outside the hospital but they are waiting for his daughter to arrive in the city and that can only happen on sunday morning uh, this is the information we are getting but it's also nice to see you can clearly see there i hope from the visuals the chief minister a few of his cabinet colleagues uh, also uh, personalities from sandalwood and various other even opposition leaders are all sitting over there um with the family members so this is what is happening a large number of people coming here very very decently there is no problem at all extremely peaceful but the police have taken care in fact as of now there are six thousand police personnel stationed across the city uh, in this particular place case uh, some 40 odd case rp platoons have been deployed along with uh, the city armed reserve and the rapid action force the police believe that they have put in pl uh, place all sorts of measures and things should go in properly but a very very sad day indeed this time uh, a sea of fans supporters coming in from all across karnataka different parts of karnataka they've come down to the kantirava stadium that itself shows the kind of clout and the influence that Puneet Rajkumar had with the people of Karnataka, of course, because of the kind of contribution he's given, his family has given, they're known as the first family of Kannada film industry uh, for, for their contribution, immense contribution to the Kannada language, the Kannada culture. That's the affection we see in the form of fans coming in in large numbers at the Kantirava Stadium. It's overwhelming crowds there. No wonder why the state government decided that Kantirava Stadium is the apt place for the final goodbye for Puneet Rajkumar. Of course, our guests here joining us. Let me